A Valley Metro bus park and ride service that would offer Valley residents and Mexican nationals transportation from the Donna Rio Bravo International Bridge to Mid Valley City shopping centers has now been delayed. CBS 4's Joel Flores finds out the reason for the holdup. Joel? Eddie, the park and ride service was a partnership between the cities of Mercedes, Hueslico, and Donna to provide Valley shoppers and Mexican nationals transportation from here, the Donna Rio Bravo International Bridge to these cities. But now, Things have changed. Donna Mayor Irene Munoz tells CBS, now Donna will only participate. The four-year project was expected to begin next month, but now Westlaco and Mercedes have decided to wait before offering the service. Officials there tell CBS4 the uncertainty of if people would actually use the transportation led them to hold off on offering the service. For now, those who choose to use the park and ride will pay a dollar to be transported to and from the bridge to the HEB and Walmart in Donna. Well, the city of Donna is going to go ahead and move forward, and uh, we just hope that uh, that uh, that they would uh, join us, you know, you know, sometime in the near future, you know. Uh, with uh, additional routes leading uh, to West Laco, uh, maybe their downtown area, and uh, Mercedes uh, to their, uh, their outlets. The park and ride facility was funded by the Federal Transit Administration and the Lower Rio Grande Valley Economic Development Council at a cost of $1.8 million. Currently, there are about 200 parking spots. The new bus route will operate every hour on the hour from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. and is expected to begin here in Donna in the next three weeks. At the Donna Rio Bravo International Bridge, Joel Flores, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com. The Ruben Hinojosa Park and Ride Facility will be equipped with television monitors and free Wi-Fi.